Hello everyone and welcome back to another beer review with me, Ruku. Now, if you see my short video that I released a little while ago, you will know um, that this was part of the unboxing series that I had. And uh, this is called Cosmic Little Thing IPA and it's a double IPA in style. Comes in at a nice respectable 8% and is from America. This is from the beer company Sierra Nevada, which I absolutely love. Um, and you can see there where it is. Um, but yeah, great, great company. Love a lot of their beers. Uh, only had a few bad ones from them, maybe like two or three. Um, but this can is awesome. I mean, it looks quite okay, doesn't it? Until you get to this part here. Look at that. That is so awesome. Like a spaceman surfing on a cosmic wave. Beautiful artwork there. Uh, apparently this is limited hazy series. Um, so it's 8% ABV and we'll see what it's got in it. It doesn't tell you. Uh, okay, so it doesn't tell you. All right, okay, good. Um, <laughs> this was, uh, I don't know when this was packaged. No idea, the 17th for the 5th, 24, so it's not too bad. Right, let's crack this bad boy open. <laughs> Any dust off there, as you do. I've got high hopes for this. I'm hoping this is going to be a nice tasting beer because, uh, you know, it just appealed to me. The name just appealed to me. This is 12 fluid ounces, by the way. I forgot to mention 12 fluid ounces. Um, it's a smaller can if you if you will. All right, look at that. That's beautiful. Beautiful. I'm going to bring you up and move some stuff around. Right, so what we've got here is what it says on the tin. It's a hazy golden color I see lots of bubbles streaming there there's your head not bad on the head front actually looks quite decent fuck me there's a fly right above my head lovely jubbly um <laughs> made me chump <laughs> so yeah you may see a, a house flyer coming in in between shots in a minute but uh it can do one right so yeah it looks really hazy it's a decent head uh, we're looking at like one finger width maybe a finger width and a half the can is really good design the beer is hazy, got some bubbles in there. So let's crack on with some aroma. There's a hint of tropical note. Um, mango, maybe a bit of passion fruit, and um, a little bit of lime as well. It's, I feel like there's a bit of lime or something in there, citrusy. But that smells great, so let's just crack straight on with the taste. Cheers, everyone. Oh wow, that is decent. Mm. Oh my, that is good. Um, straight away, what we get is a a lovely smooth mouthfeel to this. It's very smooth. There's a nice hop resin and then a hop bite that combine virtually at the same time. So you're getting an oily hoppy bite with um tropical notes um a lot of fuzz on the tongue there's a lot of hazy sort of fuzziness uh, on the tongue which i quite like it sort of adds to the mouth feel as it were but it's incredibly smooth and soft and gentle this you don't really get the alcohol hit until midway to end so it's very sort of tame at the start midway through to end you do get a bit of the alcohol um it's a bit fruity in places as well which is quite nice um, I want to say there's maybe a tiny bit of grapefruit in there as well. And what I'm saying about the alcohol, um, it's, it's very soft. It, it's not bang in your face. It's just a very, very slight gentle warmth to it um, that carries a lot of fruitiness to it and citrusy notes. I'll tell you what, this is a really great beer. <laughs> Uh, I'm having no problem drinking this. This is this is very good, and uh, I will just add as well. It is quite Moorish, so uh, don't expect this to hang around for long. If you've got one, or if your partner decides they want a piece of it, then uh, they may not get a look in because I tell you what, it's that damn good. But there it is again. That surfer dude, loving that, absolutely fantastic. <laughs> 
oh, if I burp, sign of good beer. Um, yeah, it's just nice fruity, it's hoppy, it's juicy. Uh, there's a real juiciness to it as well, which is nice. So anyway, it's a well-crafted beer and I love it. So for that reason, I'm scoring that a 10 out of 10. Lovely flavours, comes through, develops well. Um, even halfway down, still the same flavours, but it just gets nicer the more you drink it, if I'm being honest. So 10 out of 10 from me. And uh, stay tuned, guys and girls, for some more of these uh, Sierra Nevada beers because I've still got some to come. So uh, stay tuned for those. And uh, yeah, let's see what they, they've got to offer. Till next time, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And also, if you feel up to it, I dare you to share it. Thanks for watching.